Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. On this channel, I film about faith and lifestyle as it pertains to relationships. Yes, it's been a very, very long time. Where have I been? Where have I actually been? I'm asking myself, where have you been? Where have you been? <laughs> anyway guys, this is like a life update video to just talk about where I've been for the past how many months that I've not filmed. You know, being on YouTube, being consistent for a while and all of a sudden. I just ghosted YouTube. That's what I did. I ghosted YouTube. <laughs> so it's gonna be a very, very short video. Just talk about a few things and we are out of here. Um, left Oshobo. I feel like a lot of people don't know that. People still send me messages thinking I have been Oshobo. Please, I have left Oshobo a very, very long, more than five months ago. It's been a long time since I left Oshobo, so I've not been Oshobo for a while. So, for anyone who is still confused about that, yeah, you can know that I'm no longer in Oshobo. I left Oshobo and I went back home immediately after the wedding, which is like one of the last videos on my channel. Um, second to the last video because I posted a sit down video where I talked about my last heartbreak experience and everything. Yeah, that one dropped, but then I'd left the show like very, very few days after the wedding, came back home and I was like, okay, what's next? What's next? What's up? <laughs> and was just trusting God because I have prayed about certain, I had prayed about certain things and I told God what exactly I wanted and how I wanted life after NYC to look like. And you know, God being faithful and everything and he has kept every single one of it. You know, during service and getting close to the end of my service, I used to always ask, you know, I used to always think and I would be like, um... In the next six months, where will you be? In the next one year, will you look back and be like, oh, yeah, you worried too much for nothing. And I feel like I can tell myself, you worried too much for nothing. <laughs> yeah, God has really been faithful and he has been really good to me. So yeah, I finished and I came back home. Everybody was happy to see me. You know, it's been one year and everything. So everyone was glad to have me back. And I was glad to be back, but I didn't want to stay back home for too long. But I finally moved to Abuja where I got a job that I've been doing for the past yeah the past three yes past three months so yes um and it's been going great of course I'm doing something I love I'm doing social media content creation and you know learning a lot on the job and it's been a very very good ride um so far I met good people wonderful people that really really helped me grow I really really care about me and I'm really kind to me so it's been really really nice so far um, another really reason I stayed for, um, or the main reason I stayed for at first was that I was still settling down and I was trying to find time to film, you know, with work and everything. So I got to find the time to film, the space to film, and just find my life around here and know, okay, this is how it's going to be. You know, I did a lot of vlogging in Oshobo, so I was like, okay, it's going to be really, really busy here with work and everything. Will I still be able to do vlogging? Okay, should I face my relationship niche this time around? So just having a lot of questions. When I finally decided to go back into filming, I filmed the video, which will be going up like maybe several videos after this one yeah i filmed the video and i was like finally okay i'm ready to go back in less of our relationship and that video was very very interesting i've even edited it i've already uploaded it in my channel but i just kept it on private because certain things happened so i had an accident like a few days after that i had um a domestic accident and yeah you're going to see in the next vlog the whole details of it this um, injury which has already completely cleared i don't know if you see it in the camera yes this injury happened my tits happened also and I told myself like I wasn't going to upload on my channel until I had gotten my tits sorted out so finally I got my tits sorted out like two three four days ago and I was like okay it's finally time you can film you no longer have an excuse your skin is completely healed your tits is back so yeah you know no more guys you guys are going to get full details next week I just don't want this video to be long yeah so that accident happened and yeah it was terrifying at first and so surreal that's the word. It was really, really sorry for me. I felt like it was a dream. You know, one minute, everything is okay. And the next minute, two of my tits, tits, Jesus. Two of my tits is missing. And I was like, okay, you know what? You're just going to get used to having yourself look this way. And oh, how will I answer people's questions? People keep asking, what happened to you? Find your, what happened, what happened, what happened? But you know, God is so, is so wonderful. This is something that happened like a month ago. And in just one month, everything has gone back to normal. And the night it happened, I just lied down on my bed. And I was like, God, please, I just want a miracle. I just want either I have a miracle or you just touch my heart to just accept this new reality of me looking this way because it was so obvious and I was in so much pain you know and it was so obvious anybody that knew me and sees me again will know that something has really happened to me and even aside that um you know coming on my youtube channel and with you know and everything and I was just like okay god I just want a miracle just do something miraculous for me that my teeth grows I know I'm an adult that my teeth is not going to break but you can't do everything there's nothing impossible for you let my teeth grow 
I said, okay, but if you're not going to do that, please just let me be so accepting of this new reality that just by how people react, it doesn't affect me and I'm just happy with this new me and everything. And so, yeah, I started accepting it. People were trying to make me feel bad. People did. Um, I was finally accepting it. And then finally I went to the dentist and the dentist was like, okay, sorry about what happened to you, but it's not really a big deal. Like, there are solutions to these things. And yeah, he gave us options and we finally chose the options that were okay with, that prayed about it and everything. And here I am today. <laughs> Guys, I can't believe it. Sometimes I'm just like, I can't believe I have two artificial teeth in my mouth. Like, I'm a very forgetful person. I feel like before the end of this year, I won't forget that this whole thing has happened. But it was really scary. It still really is scary. In the vlog, you guys are going to see everything, um, the treatment and the injections I had to collect, the medicines I had to take. <sighs> the baby girl has seen something. But I said, let me update you guys what's been going on because it would just be somehow for me to just come back on the YouTube sits come back on the youtube space you know don't forget to subscribe check out my other content i have over 80 videos on this channel and this channel has been thriving it might not have the numbers in terms of subscribers but in terms of views this channel is actually doing very very great and it's not something i'm going to be leaving anytime soon so you can check out my other videos if you're interested in things about relationships faith christianity and lifestyle and you're just going to see the full package of a young christian girl trying to please god and I'll lie on the whole skin. I bet I'll lie. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.